I put out on Facebook that I was going to talk to you and asked if anybody had questions. And one, one struck me. And I think, I think we can all resonate with this. She worked at a crisis pregnancy center and was a counselor. And so she'd see a lot of people coming through and she would often hear these young kids come in and say, well, I'm a Christian. I wouldn't have an abortion, but you know, everybody needs to be able to make their own choice. Help us respond to that. Yeah. So we actually talk about this um, in the book for those who are interested, if you want a kind of fuller um, discussion of this, but the, the kind of simplest way that we put it in the book is I think we would all see the problem if somebody said, well, I'm Christian and so I'm against slavery, but I don't really have a problem if someone else wants to own a slave. Mm-hmm. Or, you know, I'm a Christian and I know that theft is wrong, so I wouldn't steal something. But if my neighbor wants to steal, that's okay. Right? We all recognize that certain things are right and certain things are wrong. And if something is immoral, a good and just government has a role in stopping it. Um, and so if we accept the notion that abortion, not the notion, the fact that abortion is, kills an innocent human being, um, and that it harms the mother, certainly, too, um, then I think we have a responsibility to advocate policies and support politicians and laws to make that illegal, of course, in conjunction with with cultural support for women and for families. Not for me, but for thee is not a very consistent moral position. 